Hi, what are you reading? Hi, I'm reading an article about a girl who just lost her mother due to COVID-19. Knowing that her mom was an amazing cook, she tried to honor her to the food that she loved. She cooked traditional Bengali dishes that her mom used to make to cope with her pain. However, no one had written down her mother's recipe because they thought that she would always be around. Trying her hand at all of those Bengali dishes, she realized that they weren't an exact replica of her mom's. It is so sad that we have stopped valuing family traditions and recipes. The lack of appreciation for grannies and losing traditional recipes is an unaddressed problem. Well, there has to be a solution. Presenting Granny Sula, a startup that provides personalized memory recipe work to preserve family recipes and stories. So far, we have interviewed 20 plus grandmas, brought together 25 plus families, and created over 60 plus stories. We have won 75,000 rupees in iStart a state level government competition. But wait, there's more. We are launching a book featuring 30 plus recipes with authentic tips and stories of 14 plus grandmas. So how does the solution work? Well, our model is pretty simple. Through our website, users can book an interview, which is currently only for people in Jaipur. The interview would connect with the grannies, the content writer would write their stories and the designer would design them. Lastly, we'll provide them to the family as their memory recipe book and feature them in our annual book. Here's a book we prepared. The first few pages talk about the granny, followed by the story behind the recipe, and then the recipe with the special touch of that granny. Well, what is it that makes our idea great? We highlight the granny stories, not just the recipes, and offer personalized packages. Through our annual book, we offer a glimpse into the lives of our grannies, their struggles and their triumphs. Our goal is to make our grannies the hero. Granny Stula, Tales Behind the Taste.